Hi, welcome to Sababa's Kitchen. My name is Sagi. We are going to show you how to assemble and how to make hummus plates. Um, hummus in Israel, and those, well, before that, we'll start with our ingredients. So, a fresh hummus made from scratch. We have to make good hummus. You have to get dry beans, soak them in water for 24 to 48 hours, then cook them, then add all the fun stuff in it, and create our beautiful hummus, or any hummus. We're gonna use the uh, mushrooms it's, uh, that we uh, saute them. And this one is a green sauce, we call it skug. It's uh, not too spicy, but it's like very citrusy. It has cilantro in it, and it's so, so good. Some parsley for garnish. Really good olive oil. Key, tahini, and some paprika for, just for making it look good. So, the way we start, hummus. In Israel, hummus is always made uh, plain. You don't have like spicy hummus or garlic hummus. You always make your good hummus and you put it in a plate and you open it and you make it into a bowl. After you put this, you can top it with whatever you want. Some people do the vegetables, some people do just ground beef or, or lamb or chicken. We're gonna use it with mushrooms, sauteed mushrooms. I, I usually eat mine with like ground lamb. It's chopped lamb, it's perfect. So, we put some mushrooms on it. Tahini. Olive oil. A lot of olive oil. Always good. A little bit, our green spice. It's called schogen at the top. Some parsley. And some red paprika. And this is our pita bread. Now, hummus in Israel is not a dip. It's not a sauce or it's a dip. It's a real plate. You eat it for lunch, for dinner. You come to a place and that's what you eat. Just eat hummus. The way to eat it is not with a spoon or chop it. Take the pita, make sure you grill it before so it will be warm, and just go all the way with your hands and put it in. Welcome to Salada.